So hello and welcome friends to our channel Intro Mac and here we discuss about basic mechanical engineering concepts. So in our previous session we have seen a online platform called as Virtual Labs which has been developed by institutes like IITs and NITs. So this platform offers the simulation of different experiments from different engineering subjects like dynamics of machinery or let's say strength of materials from mechanical side so you can find labs from different branches from like electronics engineering computer engineering then biotechnology mechanical civil so this platform offers a huge variety of labs with uh, you know simple animations and simulations so you can learn a lot of things from uh, this online platform so without wasting time let's check out what this platform is so type virtual labs in the google and you could see the site so just click on it and you will go to the home page so this is the home page so you can read the objective to provide the remote access to simulation based labs in various disciplines of science and engineering right and it is developed by the institutes like all the iits and nit so this is a very great platform to learn the things and you could see the areas which they have covered it is all the branches of engineering right so let's check out some of the topics which are related to mechanical engineering and common in civil engineering so these are the labs in uh, civil engineering and these are the institutes which have developed these uh, labs right so let's check out uh, today the strength of material lab which is developed by NIT Suratkal just click on it and here the home page of the strength of material lab you can read the objective the least of expense you have ISO, Charpy uh, impact test then the direct shear stress then the hardness test, tensile stress, compression, torsion all these things are covered over here so let's check out uh, some experiment and how uh, the simulation interface looks like so let's check the Brinell hardness test you can see the aim to determine the indentation hardness of mild steel cast and brass then there is a theory uh, what is the machine how it is tested what is the formula so you can read all these things and apply this is the theory so you can read these things when then we have a procedure that how to use the simulation wizard then we have a self evaluation test and here it is Grinnell hardness test interface you can read the objective the operators use then the, we have a step one you can read the step we have a different four metals like cast iron you can have the properties of uh, this cast iron then brass and aluminium right so we have picked up the cast iron let's move on so just follow the arrows and you can read along with that we have loaded the work piece then we have to give the load uh, to the thing so it will show just start the machine so just go there and give the load for say 30 seconds you can read the step also it has been mentioned over here like 10 to 15 minutes then we have to unload so just unload the part right and then we can check the indentation mark we have to take some values from that and then we have to put those values uh, we have measured the diameter of the indentation we have to put those values in the formulae and here we have got the Brinell hardness number of the cast iron right so this is the trial one and uh, with the similar thing we can you can change the material like uh, first time we have uh, taken the uh, we can have the trial view so always uh, we take some of the trials and then we do the average of that so that's why we are, are taking the second trial so in many experiments we do the same thing for a lot of times and then we take the average thing right so we are repeating the process and then finally we have got the average value right here you could see the average linear hardness number right because we have taken two experiments so the same thing you can uh, carry out with different materials and you can check out their hardness number Brinell hardness number and you can compare them which is harder one which is uh, like comparatively softer so this is how you can
carry out you can go beyond uh, you can go backward again you can go to this simulation thing and now you can go with let's say brass mode you have to again carry the same procedure and you can check the hardness of the brass and then you can come back right so uh, this is how we have carried out the hardness test right and let's check out some uh, another test so what we have we have a lot of uh, different tests over here so we can just uh, check some other uh, other experiments also so i think this is a great platform and you can learn the things by going nowhere you just have to go on to the web page which is totally free and you can do some steps and you will get the results you can analyze those results and you can improve your knowledge right so this is great for platform try to share it and try to use it so this is it for the today's session and thank you for your patient listening so if you have any doubts please do write into the comment section until then stay home stay happy thank you Thank you.